and welcome to our very first Raw Sound Extra. So we're here with the lads from Crimson. How are you doing, boys? Yeah, good, thank you. Good, good. So we've got Luke, Patrick, Dan and Charlie. Yeah, so what have you been up to lately, lads? Recording or doing anything during lockdown? Working. Working? <laughs> yeah. yeah, we've um, been recording our uh, new EP that's coming out after all these singles. But we've also been practising for uh, gigs we've got in August and uh, just trying to polish the sound off because um, we've had some trouble with kind of uh, vocals uh, in the past. I won't say too well, much. not in the past, a few weeks ago. Yeah, a few weeks ago. We, it past, is in the past, past, but very recently. As, yeah. in, as in being able to sing or back uh, in no, vocals? We, <laughs> <laughs> we can both sing, but just not together. <laughs> we just find it very difficult to sing together. Well, I think, I think we can that. I think yeah. it's, uh, we, just, yeah. we just practiced the instrumentation, got that right, and then my brother recorded the gig on his GoPro uh, a few weeks ago, and then we listened to him and we thought, oh, so uh, that's what most of our time has been spent on, just getting the harmonies right. And hopefully we got that right tonight. So Yeah, because I think the songs could sound amazing instrument-wise, instrument but if the vocals are crap, then it just uh, mars the whole experience, which is yeah. frustrating. But yeah, it's all, it's all part of it, isn't it? So it all needs to a be lesson right. Learned, a lesson learned. Yeah. yeah. So you've been in the studio? Uh, well, we do all our own stuff, so we all we produce all our own stuff. Well, when I say we, Luke. I mean Luke. Charlie's got his own studio. Oh, fantastic! Well, it's, not a stu- it's not a studio. It's not really a studio. It's just somewhere where we can yeah, like record, a real really. kind of room. Yeah. Right, and you take charge. You're doing the recording. Yeah. Yeah. I'm the only one who knows what he's doing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know about that. Oh, Charlie. Charlie knows what he's doing. Basically, I want to know more about these gigs in August. What have you got? Come in. Charlie? What have we got? Uh, ooh, um, August 7th, isn't it? August yeah? 7th. Yeah, we're headlining... Is it Mothers? Mothers. Yeah. Mothers, yep. Yeah. I'm good at these details. And oh, great amazing. promotion. Yeah. And then um, on the 15th of August, so the Sunday, uh, we're playing the Sonic Gun Weekender, which should be pretty good. And then at the end of August, we've got a gig uh, somewhere in Birmingham. Uh, <laughs> somewhere. Institute. Anywhere. Institute. Anywhere. Institute. Kind of- I don't know, it's somewhere. Oh, two somewhere. Yeah. One of the O2s. One of the O2s. O2s. One of the O2s. <laughs> to be <Excellent>. continued. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So the, the weekender you're doing, yeah, where's that very at? very low down on the uh, list. So at the Castle and Falcon. Yeah. So yeah, we're one of the first on, but I mean, I went to the last Sonic and Weekender. Yeah, it was good. And yeah, I've seen the videos when you guys did the um, the live one. Yeah. And it looked really good. Yeah. So yeah, it's exciting to just be part of something like that. Same yeah. day Sugar Thief, so that'll be that'll be good on the evening. Free them. ticket, free ticket to Sugar Thief. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fantastic, yeah. That, yeah. Great local band. Yeah. So, what about the football? Been watching the football? Oh, of course. Of course. Who's, who's not watching the football? All England fans? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Even Dan McHale's watching really. the football, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah so. Dan McHale. Yeah. Any, any, <laughs> predi- any predictions for the final? I think England, Italy. Obviously, I don't know the result tonight. Did Italy win? I don't know. We don't no. know the result. Oh, Do we know did. the result? Yeah, Italy won. won. Oh, OK. OK, yeah. 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 I probably so. think, yeah, it's it, England, Italy. Yeah. They're bloody big. And I know that they wear a blue uniform after tonight's chat. I know so much about football. <laughs> is, it not, is it not a uniform? It's a half piece. marks, half yeah. marks. You got the right colour. It's a kit. Yeah. That, that's, that's the only. I was going to say that's the only contribution I have towards a football conversation. Is what colour is, is their uniform? <laughs> yeah, I think uniform sounds quite regiment. I think that sounds quite cool. Yeah. Yeah. A bit better than kit. He'll let you off. It's like you're a team. You know what I mean? Like a. I don't know, like an army. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll start a poll off and try and get him to change yeah, it. Yeah. For Daniel's sake. Yeah. Yeah. Great. So now I gather you've s- famous people at your school. Um, Jack Grealish went to my primary school. And secondary. That's, he went to secondary school as yeah. well. Yeah. And his, his mom comes into uh, my mum and dad's card and gift shop, so does that. <laughs> Plug. Uh, That's and, adorable. Yeah. <laughs> Bentley's cards and gifts. So I, I get the rundown, all the gossip behind the scenes uh, from Karen Grealish. And, then, um, and he, he used name to, dropping as well. Yeah, <laughs> name he, drop number two. Um, and he, he used to live at my road, so that's uh, that's our claim to fame. So. So did you used to play football with him, or? Absolutely not. <laughs> no, 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 no. Is that because he was too good, or you weren't good enough? He wasn't quite on my. I was teaching him, and he, was, he just wasn't quite there yet. So I didn't play with him. I just taught him, and then oh, he's gone on to do great things. So I'm just proud of him. Really. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good. So what about who do we support? Villa. Yeah. Of course, Villa. Yeah. Villa. Fans at the end there. Oh, and then Liverpool. Because oh, I'm the only one who knows. Uh, I don't really know much about football, so I'm a Blues fan. <laughs> That's a brilliant answer. Yeah. So you're a Liverpool fan? Yeah. Yeah. Any particular reason? My father and oh, what? Okay. All his family from Liverpool. Oh, right, so okay. oh well. That's just the way it was. Fair enough. That's a good enough reason. Take that. Yeah. So what else we got? Um, time for a look at gigs, I think. Yes. So upcoming gigs in our area. Birmingham. Uh, so we have Ace Ambrose with five others 
performing there as well at Chaos on the 21st of July at the Grey Lantern. More at the Grey Lantern, we've got Mark Morris and support from Sam Lambeth on the 23rd of July. Another Grey Lantern gig for you, Eva from Leeds on the 24th of July. And then Marstone and the Strays at the Grey Lantern again on the 30th of July. And then we have Oliver Beardmore at the Sunflower Lounge 22nd of July. And finally, Frankensteiner at the Sunflower Lounge on the 24th of July. So be sure to check any of those out online if you're interested in going to any of those gigs. Fantastic. Now, so should we have a look at the reason why you guys are here tonight? Have a little look at your performance from the show? Yeah. Uh, Sneak so let's have a little look. Yeah, this is the guys uh, from Crimson with their latest single, Juvenilia. So that was brilliant. That was a great performance from the lads from Crimson from this Sunday's show. This was their latest single, Juvenilia. So you've just recorded that, lads? Yeah. How long's that one been out? About um, a week and a half, maybe? Yeah, a yeah, week, like week and a half from today. Oh, fantastic. So still promoting that one? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, brilliant. Music video. Uh, music video coming out soon. Um, soon. That's filmed, down to me, yeah. Sorry. Filmed, edited, <laughs> directed by uh, Mr. Dan McHale here. Oh, fantastic. Probably be able to tell when you watch it, but... Uh, <laughs> Quite a talented bunch. You've got producers and directors and editors. True, yeah. Football yeah. teachers. Got, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 It's just all Dan, really. Dan's a man of many trades. No. A jack of all trades, sorry. Yeah. Master of none. <laughs> yeah. Still, still better than master of one. Yeah. That's, that's the end of the phrase. Fair enough. Yeah. Yeah. So, anyway, if you want to catch this week's show, we also have um, Grey Wave, who were fantastic for us earlier on in the evening. We have Head Shrinkers, who performed for us on the last series and also Perry Manning so don't miss that that's this Sunday and join us for our next Raw Sound Extra on Wednesday the 21st of July so from me and the boys and Danielle I'm going to say goodbye and we'll see you Sunday bye bye <laughs>